All right, in this video, we are going to be writing expressions as natural logarithms. So what we're really doing, um, we are going to be condensing, all right, writing as a single logarithm. So uh, this is actually, it's problem 19 from your book on page 481. All right, so we're going to start with 2 natural log, which it's written as ln, that means log base e, of 8 minus 3 natural log of 4. Okay, think of natural log as log base e. Well, the same properties that apply to logarithms where we wrote the word log. Okay, so remember, log with a base of e is the same thing as saying ln. It just has its own symbol. Okay? So, same properties. So, I can use the power property and say natural log of 8 to the second power minus, using the power property here, natural log of 4 to the third power. Okay? Well, now, we know that 8 to the second power um, is 64, because 8 times 8 is 64. All right, so we write, we can say natural log ln of 64 minus, now 4 to the third power is 64 natural log of 64. Now, I don't want you to put 0 here, okay, because it's not actually. We have to use that quotient property, and this is natural log of 64 over 64. So that means we have the natural log of 1. Now, the actual answer um, for this problem is natural log of 1. We are not asked to do any evaluating or anything. Okay, so this is our answer because we're t told write it as a natural logarithm, a single logarithm. All right, have fun with these.